Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. I thought I was done for the day, honest to god. Uh, I wasn't going to be planning on recording a recap video until, for, until much later. I was going to about to take a nap. But, the Winnipeg Jets aren't done yet, by the play, apparently. Even though it's been almost two and a half hours since the trade deadline has ended, there are rumblings and confirmed reports about the Winnipeg Jets making more moves. Even though this is basically an AHL-level trade, it, nonetheless, my friends, is a Winnipeg Jets trade. The Winnipeg Jets, according to David Paganta, and is confirmed by the Jets' Twitter account, have acquired Marcus Phillips, defenseman, from the Los Angeles Kings in exchange for defenseman Nelson Noje. Nelson Noje is a long-time member of the Manitoba Moose. Uh, he's been around for a long time. He's been an assistant captain. Very well liked by the city of Winnipeg and by the uh, staff and just the whole organization with True North and the Manitoba Moose and Winnipeg Jets. So a very, very surprising move. But nonetheless, as you can see right there, it was confirmed by the Winnipeg uh, Jets on their Twitter account. Goodbye, Nelson Noje. Hello, Marcus Phillips. So I guess what we should do is just do a little rundown of who these guys are. Basically, as you can see right here, Nelson Noje is one of those prospects that have been, basically has been a D prospect for a very long time. A fourth round pick back in 2014 um, has spent a lot of time with the Manitoba Moose. As you can see, one, two, three, four, five, six seasons with the Manitoba Moose, as well as playing in 11 NHL games for the Winnipeg Jets and not being able to register any points uh, at all and taking five penalty minutes as well. So re basically a career AHLer. Um, he has had some good moments in uh, Winnipeg with the Moose and you know I'm going to miss him for that sense, uh, side of things because it's always nice to see familiar faces with the Moose and Nelson Noje has definitely been a familiar face with the Moose. He's been on the Moose since 2016-17. So yeah, goodbye Nelson Noje. Good luck with the Ontario Reign and uh, I wish you the best for the rest of your hockey career. Now on the flip side of this coin, Marcus Phillips. Marcus Phillips is actually a pretty interesting player because not only is he 23 years old compared to Nelson Noje, who is 25 years old, but he was also drafted more recently and also has a little bit more better stats in my opinion. Both are defensemen. Uh, both are pretty good. Both are basically full-time AHLers at this point. Uh, Marcus Phillips hasn't even made an NHL game yet. He is still yet to play in the NHL. So when you look at his time, you know, in 2019-20, he spent some time with the OH in the OHL with the London Knights. Had 11 points in 25 games. Was pretty decent with them. With the rain, he's been pretty good as well. This year in 38 games, played a goal, four assists for five points. Uh, he won as well, if I'm not mistaken. He won the uh, Calder Trophy or whatever. The Memorial Cup, I believe it was, it's what it's called for... Uh, uh, the juniors, he won it with uh, the Gulf Storm, I believe. Uh, so yeah, he's had some success. He's a winner, and I honestly think he's kind of an interesting guy to bring in. He's uh, six foot, two hundred pounds. Uh, I don't know what we're gonna expect here, but maybe he'll be a good fit with the Moose, and who knows? Maybe he'll be another good defensive depth piece to call on upon times when we have injury problems. So I'm not gonna play and complain with this. I actually think it's kind of a dub because. Marcus Phillips looks to be a younger, better version of Nelson Noje right now compared to what Nelson Noje is. So at the end of the day, I'm not going to complain. It's another trade, and I kind of like it. So let me know what your thoughts are on this. If you're a Moose fan, what's your favorite memory of Nelson Noje? If you're a Kings fan, what can you tell us about Marcus Phillips? I would love to know more about him. So with all that being said, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Go check out all my other videos that I've uploaded today covering the NHL trade deadline as well. I will have a recap video coming out later tonight talking about all the moves that were made today. It was a very busy and active deadline. So with all that being said, peace. Peace, love, and positivity as always. Thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to follow me on Twitter, Instagram. Check out all the affiliate links down in the description below. Have a great rest of your day. Go Jets go! And bye bye